purchasing information records play a vital role in streamlining procurement process by eliminating the need to re-enter information. Join me as I demonstrate how to create purchasing information records or PIRS using the ME11 transaction code. Here's the breakdown of the steps we will cover. Open the ME11 transaction code and press enter to access the create information record general data screen. Begin by entering the supplier number 101000. In the material field, enter bolt 2023. Next, for the purchasing organization, you enter US zero zero and plant MI zero zero. Press enter to proceed. Focus on the supplier data area on the create information record gen general data screen. Set reminders for the material delivery by entering the desired number of days. For example, enter minus one to send a reminder one day before the material should be delivered. Enter the supplier's material number, raw material 2023, representing how the material is identified in supplier's system. Next, to the purchase order, unit of measure section. The order of unit means you will be ordering in each and the, the conversion here is equal one each for one each. Ensure the order unit matches the quantity you will order and set the conversion if needed. For example, if ordering a box and receiving 100 each, that information will be entered here. Click on the purchasing organization data one. First, you will enter your plant delivery time field. The plant delivery time is the default amount of days for when material delivery is planned. You will enter two. Now you must enter your purchasing group. You will click the match code and you will choose N00. The next required field is standard quantity. The standard quantity is the number you typically order of this material from this supplier. You will enter 100 each. In the minimum quantity, you will enter 1 each as the minimum order you would ever make and in the maximum quantity you will enter one ten thousand as the largest order you would ever make of this material from this supplier next the condition area you here you can enter the net price your net price is your final price per each. You enter 50 cents per each. Once you have entered all the necessary information, click the save button. A green su success message will confirm that your purchasing information record has been created. Creating a purchasing information record, you ensure that the net price would automatically populate when creating a purchase order for the specified material and supplier. This eliminates the need for manual data entry and provide confidence in the accuracy of the information on your future purchase orders.